Hey, Ethan. Billy Parsons here from Jim Glover Dodge. Hey, buddy, I appreciate you calling me, man, giving me another chance to earn your business. That means a lot to me, buddy. I, I work strictly off of repeat and referrals, usually. Um, and so, it means a lot to me. I'm inside this Mojave Edition Gladiator. This is a, basically a souped-up Rubicon. It's from the factory, all factory. But this one here has already got their navigation, your heated seats, your forward-facing camera, your back-facing camera, your hitch pin and everything right there. Um, XM satellite radio, navigation, the whole nine. I'm gonna put that, it is really cold, bro. <laughs> I don't know why they had it on AC, but I gotta turn it up. Um, let me do this right here. Let's just sync that, okay? Uh, but anyway. Power locks, power windows, and not all of them have them these days, but the Gladiator, you'll be fine. With the trim levels I'm showing you, they're gonna have power locks and power windows. Um, now the Mojave has kind of some orange accents to it, and this is made for extreme off-roading too. I mean, you can do extreme off-roading in this. This is like the Baja version of the Gladiator. You could take this out in the desert and jump some sand dunes. It's got tune shocks. It, it's off-road pages and everything right there, buddy. I'm gonna get out and walk around it real quick. You can disengage your sway bar here, and I was telling you that on the Rubicons, you can disengage your axle lockers here. So, it's a pretty nice setup. Push button start, remote start right there, automatic. We'll kind of get away from it and walk around it and I'll point out a few things that this one would have versus that one right over there which is a sport I just want you to be able to compare brother this one's already got the blacked out wheels all-terrain Falcon tires you notice the tops painted see over there this one's tops painted the fender flares are painted so it gives it that really crisp, clean look. And this is the only, <clears throat> this is the only model you're gonna find the hood scoop on, and I like the hood scoop. I think it gives it that aggressive look in the front versus one of these, no hood scoop, hood scoop. You notice no LED headlights, okay, no LEDs. Look at this one, LED headlights. Tow hooks in the front. Those LEDs, brother, they are nice. Now, I'm not saying those aren't in the LED. You could add aftermarket LEDs to those to make it look like this. But this is all factory equipment. This one right here is all factory. We haven't done a lift, wheels, or tires on it yet. It comes with a factory Mopar lift with Fox shocks, all of that from the factory. This one sits a little higher. And you could jump some hills in this, get out in the sticks with them dogs. Um, you're not gonna get stuck nowhere in this one. And just to look at it, this has the orange trim. It's the only one that'll have the orange stitching in it. And look to the front. Power outlets in the back. Oh, you got your mid-range speakers in the roll cage. See that roll cage? And this one even has the headliner. Not all of them have the headliner in it. Your back glass is power. Um, Fox shocks all the way around. And this one has LED tail lights. Now this one also has, already has the tow pack on it. I see. Dampen tailgate. Anyway, Ethan, I hope this helps. I mean, just to give you an idea this is a sport now i know you're going to change the wheels and tires this is a sport that has the factory painted fender flares not all the fender flares are painted to give you an idea this one's stickers at 44. um and this this model here i don't have the keys to it but would give you most of the stuff you would want your uh, power locks, power windows, automatic, that type of stuff. 
It's just not as finished out as like a Mojave. Um, and you mentioned a black one. Now we've already put the lift wheels and tires on this one. This is a Rubicon, but man. <laughs> and this got the LEDs in the front. Even Rubicons are not ordered with these. They don't come standard with those. They have to, every trim level has to be ordered with those. But uh, this one's already got the lift wheels and tires. We've added fuel, Neato Ridge Grappler tires. And I'll get you some measurements, um, Ethan. They put the extra tire wheel in here. You don't have to do that. We could put your, your uh, dog kennels in there. But anyway, Ethan, I hope this helps. I'm a visual guy myself. I like to be able to see it, but if you stick it out with me, buddy, I'll come out here and get your videos. We'll narrow it down, get your trade evaluation. And if I need to bring it all the way to you, like I did Haley's, I'll do it, brother. And I appreciate y'all's business, man. Y'all been awesome to work with. Over here at Jim Glover, Glover Dodge, Haley, Ethan, we want your business.